Hello my friends, welcome back to some fun whip and chat. We will work on a diamond painting of these beautiful blue flowers. And I picked this very dark blue color today because I have a big patch in here of the same symbol. And this is actually the other side of the canvas, opposite side. This is the right side of the canvas and I have no diamonds in here placed at all. But it will be easy for me to record video for you. So we're just gonna go with it and place in here. Uh, now Catherine in here next to me, she's working on a puzzles we bought for her for Christmas, uh, or that wasn't Christmas Catherine, no. that wasn't a Christmas. We went shopping one time and we, we bought a puzzles, there is like, f how many inside? Uh, 12 or 15, uh, there's a, lots of puzzles up there in one box. So she did already once. And I posted picture on my Instagram that was a gorgeous flowers and now she's working on the other one and it's a very tiny pieces of puzzles and also I purchased one for myself and I will show you on the end so right now we just kind of she work on her puzzle I will work on my diamond painting because she's taking a break time from school and and but now well we have a 10 minutes for now to record this video then she will start her school again so i will have to stop my video and do something else till she's done school so yeah it's a little bit obstacles to record video these days but what you gonna do diamonds looks good we maybe we could even play in here by the checkerboard or just place one by one doesn't matter so many of you like this canvas and me too i, I really really love this um canvas let me refill my pen maybe i'm just gonna grab another pen i have so many pens in here that has a wax already in it I literally gonna just try everyone so I don't waste your time and see if you can place a little bit with the other one I don't empty my wax every time I finish diamond paint so sometimes you know it could go a long time uh, without refilling and sometimes you can refill more than you know more often because the wax could be dry out or just not enough and you need to make it more fuller because every time you push your diamond down to the canvas uh, it wax kind of coming out from under the pan and you need to put more it's a beautiful sunny day today and guess what tomorrow they promise i think 15 centimeters of snow so I'm kind of like enjoying seeing the grass right now on my window. Tomorrow probably you will see some snow and body running on it because he loves to roll on the snow. He go cuckoo. He running around and making uh, snow angels. I love to see that. Usually Catherine take him. <laughs> yeah. Oh, two diamonds stuck in here. Hold on. When Catherine take him, I'm not gonna say the word because as soon as he hear me say O U T, then he would come in here and wait until to do the stuff. So we kind of spelling game in here. So he is not. He don't know what we talking about. But he's sometimes too smart and he can recognize that we are talking about him. I was going to clean my craft room downstairs, reorganize a little bit. I bought a beautiful softy rug. As soft as the Puma cross stitch and not the Puma Cougar uh, that I wildcat cross stitch in. I went to Costco. I don't know if you have Costco in your areas. 
and I have a rug so soft it's not real rug it's a uh, you know polyester but it's so soft it's almost like a real fur and it just remind me of my wild cat picture and I just that's it I have to have a so I got that one but I need to do clean up a little bit more so I can place that rug on the floor and when I do some crafting it's nice and cozy for my feet yes uh, and what happened one we have a two lights up there on the ceiling and one of the lights for some reason stopped working so we unfortunately we can't go to the store right now to buy the other lights that I like it because that store is closed and only curb picking but I don't like shopping online and curb picking I'm just gonna wait till store open so we try to put the, the one that doesn't work down so my husband unscrewed the one from the ceiling and he said, well, let's go to the store and see if we can find something that is nice and bright because I want a very bright light up there. It's a basement and it's dark area. Uh, so we went to Walmart. There's only one type up there. I didn't find nothing. And of course, every other store is shut down. So I came home. I thought, okay, it's evening already. I kind of can use some cleaning up. So I went downstairs, turn light on, and it's not working at all. So when we unplug one light, the other one stopped working too. And I was like, wow, that's a crazy electrician work, electrical work. So I say, you know, my husband says, maybe I can fix it if I put all those wires together and just leave them like this on the ceiling till we buy new lights. And hopefully the other one will kind of connect to it. So he did that, sure enough, the other lights work. So now <laughs> I kind of have like a half of the house downstairs with the light. And where my crafty area, it's no light. But to record video up there, I use my rain light and it's very, very bright. So it kind of work for me. But yeah, I can't really do much up there at night because it's dark and I don't want to use my ring light because it's really kind of very bright. It's bothering my eyes if I would look on it. So only kind of like in the daytime I can go and do something up there and then at night I really can't do much. So that's my dilemma right now. But I don't mind not to clean up because I brought her to diamond painting with you right now than clean who like cleaning oh nobody like cleaning right <laughs> oh but sometimes chores is good Catherine says uh-uh chores not good <laughs> puzzles better uh-huh well you it's now 152 how much more time you give me two more minutes mm -hmm. okay ladies and gentlemen we have Two more minutes before she kicked me out of here and then <laughs> actually we can see what she's doing what kind of puzzle she's doing let's go pick up on her I tidy this puzzle this puzzle literally oh my god my iPad probably bigger than this puzzle look how cute um so it's a face in this way let's see I just we, started what what do we see half an hour all? ago what do, you, what do you think up there on the picture will be? It looks like a bridge something. Yeah, that's the first piece I did. So this is very, very tiny. And to show you how tiny, look, this is really tiny pieces. And then she created the other one, let me show you. And this one, of course, is bigger one. And it's a beautiful... Uh, that took two days. Yeah, it took her two days to do it. And great job. Like a bouquet Pretty. of flowers in the box. Coming out. Yeah, she did a great job. And this piece is to like to compare to my fingers is that one. This one like a normal bigger one. So this is like a whole bunch of you don't have the box in here, no? No, you don't. In my room, I can um, get it. Uh, that's okay. I I'll will it. Okay, go get it. So this one is how many pieces you think? Two fifty me? 300? 
Okay, so this is 300 pieces. The one she's making of right now, we need to take a guess how many pieces would be up there. Oh, so let's see in a box. Is. Come on. And can you bring me my puzzle so I can show at the same time? Mm -hmm. By on uh, the fireplace. So she did this one. So it's a 12 puzzle in one box. But the problem is it's only, if I can show you like this, look at this. It's a whole bunch of bags which doesn't have a picture what on it. So you have to kind of create it before you figure out what this is. And now she using it with the bridge. Okay, so that's what she's doing. A very tiny. So this 150. Are all 150. We have 300. And we have a three puzzles. Four. Oh, no. Four? Four. There's some 500 puzzles. And I 300 and 150 and then I went to Walmart and I bought it puzzles of my favorite artist let me show you Josephine Wall Where look you know at from? this oh my goodness I know her because I see lots of her cross stitches she just a uh, lots of uh, gorgeous paint and she has all this majestic and this one is called uh, I do appreciate that actually this is uh, legit puzzles because Earth Angel and her name and I guess that was created in like a buffalo in the states or what? Uh, thousand pieces this one but look how beautiful. I believe it's still made in China. Let me flip to another side. That's what cool. we see in here, yes, it is uh, made in China, but it's definitely um, like a protective probably piece that 100% recycled paperboard. That's, That's good, good to know, yes. Uh, and here it is, you can check it out their website if you wish. They have a Facebook, uh, Pinterest and um, Twitter, which I did not look up there yet. But the image itself is absolutely stunning. I would cross stitch this. Oh, so pretty. Look, there's so much is going on. There's the birds up there. Uh, there is a village up there. Oh, yeah. Yes, um, and then there's some like kind of like one? a, oh, hold on. Maybe I can zoom close instead. There's a whole bunch of animals running in here, dolphins, her hair, no, the, her dress made as like an ocean, it's like a sky in here, then ocean um, gold, and it's like a butterflies in here, so much is going on, I love this, and here you go, peace, dove, love, I like the wings, earth angel for sure, love, love, love her gorgeous face, so Josephine Wall is my favorite, favorite artist of all, I think, so far. Mm, and I love lots of artists, but her art right now is number one to me. And uh, I really love this kind of, like, it's, you can look at her pictures and you can see something new all the time because there's so many details. Uh, and that's what I love it. So, okay, Catherine gonna start right now her school. And I will be maybe cross-stitching quietly while she's doing her work. And we will continue diamond painting after that. See you soon. Say bye, Catherine. Bye. Okay, we can continue for a few more minutes. Time is really expensive right now. <laughs> To find a free time. Seriously. So when Catherine was at school, I managed to place lots of diamonds on the symbol L. So I can show you faster. I decided not to cross stitch because her time at school was to read the book so she read the book for me and I was diamond painting and listen mother and daughter time oh, and really enjoying this diamond painting
hopefully today I will be manage to record two more videos so I can have all them line up for you to the end of this week and some for the next week I want to create videos ahead a little bit so then I can get my project done a little bit faster and show you more progress like that would give me more time to record not record but enjoy cross stitching because it's taking a longer time to see some progress instead of uh, diamond painting diamond painting we see faster progress but cross stitching it really take a longer time so if I record for you videos every day a little bit faster then I have more time to enjoy cross stitching for myself and yeah show you some progress on it right now as I record this video it's 25th and my plan was to have two videos today okay I will stop right now because my husband just pulled in the driveway see you shortly well my friends few days later we are gonna continue with you to work and those blue flowers unfortunately not always is good recording time you know since I miss point daylight for diamond painting at uh, a certain time and then later it's just too dark and at evening I just I can't record video in evening whips and chats because it's very dark and create lots of shadows so now it's 12 30 daytime and it's kind of good and bright from the window so yes a few days later now it's a uh, January 29 as I recorded and we already sandboxing I think we did if I'm right of this pan yes and I will test it out and work with the one placer of this one pretty one so I just gonna put my wax in here Stab a wax in a pen and we will work with new pen and work on the same symbol. I think last time we worked with you it was L, so we will continue on this. I'm not sure if I put enough wax in here, but let's work for now. Very cold today. Okay, looks like it's. I don't have enough wax just a minute when new pen you kind of need to stab a few times till till you have enough okay I don't understand still feels like it's not enough going deep or what just a minute give me a time I'm just gonna put a few more because when wax a pen new the wax keep going deeper and deeper let's see how much do I need still going inside wow when it's new okay let's see if it's enough now okay looks like it's better now it's grabbing it So yeah, if you have a pen like this, you really have to stab lots of glue to all fill in to this part to here. Because you can you put glue in in and just keep pushing down, down, down. But it's comfortable to work. I love how how to hold in here. We are waiting storm, snowstorm on Monday. I prepared for this long time ago. It's not like I'm going to be outside. Just to let puppy out and that's it. 
gonna it's, it will be like you know perfect day for crafting as you watch in this video it should be January 30th so it's mean tomorrow is my YouTube anniversary yay we made it another year and I'm really really grateful for you because you know without you it would be no me And hopefully next week we will start some kind of video tutorials about technical stuff about YouTube and all that stuff as I promised you before I think I'm ready uh, I will be ready to do stuff um, on Monday I will have person come to actually finally finish fixing my computer because the day when he's supposed to come here he called my husband that he was in touch with person of COVID and he was in a quarantine for two weeks but he tested positive thank goodness and now it will be two weeks gone so on Monday I will have him to fix my computer put some new parts in it and hopefully after that my computer will work faster and better and I will start record my videos that everybody is waiting for and I'm actually excited for you for those who decided to start your own channel that's awesome I think you are doing great decision um, to be a youtuber because it's a it's a beautiful community if well sometimes it could be nasty community it depends but if you just keep positivity that's good and I think in, in crafting community there's not much negativity usually it's in a beauty community lots of squeaks and uh, <laughs> negative stuff and a crafting it just depends on people's personality but I will always encourage you not to be influenced by something bad just keep your head up stay positive and you will do great and we will we will do videos about I will teach you how to overcome some obstacles to begin with as I learned from my own experience so whatever was kind of bothering me in the beginning I will teach you how to avoid that um, because the kind of I was sad to see that some of my friends decided to quit YouTube channel because they couldn't handle the pressure um, yeah so that's okay if um, I will guide you I will guide you I will teach you everything you need to know and I think I'm finally ready to do that so next week I will start to record some videos <clears throat> I appreciate uh, for everyone who want more <laughs> videos from me about the whips and chat I was surprised to, to hear that I feel like I don't have enough videos of diamond painting I didn't think uh, I thought I have for both kind of most like a even amount diamond paintings and cross stitching but I guess uh, the most that you wanted it's this kind of video like whips and chats uh, but I just want to let you know okay I will tuck and I will change color of my diamonds in here right now um, I just sometimes um, and I want you to understand when I have a PR package to unbox 
I have to do them as soon as possible and if it's a big package I have to split them in few videos uh, because that's what's required by the company and you know I need to put this video first and if it's a you know cross stitching I have to do cross stitching and sometimes I even do two video per day cross stitch and um, diamond painting so both of your fans will be happy um, uh, let me think maybe we will go with the symbol D now I have a chunk in here D let me just find a color 12 <clears throat> yeah so uh, sometimes I post even two just to make sure I have for both fans of diamond painting and cross stitching uh, but don't worry, i not quitting diamond painting, no way. I love it too much to quit. Uh, but do I have lots of cross stitching? Yes, I do. Um, because, you know, this was my very first craft that I actually learned how to do from my mom. And I missed that. So at night, uh, it's much better for me to do cross stitching because I can use magnifying glass but I cannot really record video of diamond painting at night because not good light I don't like when I see my shadow of my fingers going like see like for now when I do it's nice and bright and when I do later on then it's very kind of dark so at night I cross stitch a lot so maybe that's why I don't have too much progress of diamond paint and finishing canvases because uh, cross stitching is from same companies as diamond painting and I have to do review for them as well because lots of fans of cross stitching wanted to know if canvas good or not and I already discovered some canvases that are really good and some of them that is really bad so for me it's important both kind of crafts to see and review as soon as possible but don't worry I did not quit my diamond painting I do and I do off camera very often because I pre-record some video like I could record three sometimes video a day to pre-schedule them so I can have more time later for myself just not to worry about noises in the background, kids yelling or dog running around with cat and I just do it for myself and you know that doesn't bother that it's loud but for me to record video I need to be absolutely quiet to make this more professional you know not being uh, noises too much in the background because it really bothers me if I record video and all of a sudden, you know, my cat start talking to me, that's a little annoying. He actually sleeping right now on the sofa, so cute. Put his paw to, to him. Oh my goodness, he's sleeping so cute. But okay, I'm not going to turn on camera right now. I don't want to wake him up and start to talk to me. Because he is a talking cat, man. Especially when he demand to give him something yummy. Uh, I didn't show you kind of close diamonds. They are also of course blue but much brighter than we did with you. First color. So as I read my comments by now from my latest unboxing um, lots of you love new unboxing and some of you really actually want to see and some of you say that I save your money because that electric wolf was colorful one that you wanted to order and now you know it's a double-sided glue and you decided that now you don't want to order um, but you know as I say the canvas was actually very beautiful it just the um, fact that it's double sided glue yeah it's gonna make it feel suspicious but with round diamonds I don't think it will be bad especially when 
it's secure very tight on the roll so the glue not damaged but yes it is kind of feel bad that it's a um, double sided glue and I totally understand so that's why sometimes review is so important but I wonder if some other company maybe have same image in a proper glue well not proper that would be wrong to say but in pour on glue you know what I mean okay <coughs> Just a minute. Catherine, Catherine made me tea. So I will drink the tea. I know I behind a little bit on answering to some emails. Uh, lately I have lots of questions on Instagram uh, maybe um, uh, maybe under this video if you wish you can put some question that is bother you uh, it doesn't matter if it's a diamond painting or cross stitching uh, ask me a question under this video and I will collect them all and in my next like whip and chat maybe um, when I get lots of questions that we can do like Q&A video and I can answer or maybe even with some kind of tutorial on those questions so yeah that would be maybe nice to do if you wish to do so okay I just keep worried that I will be go <laughs> after focus hopefully not I talked to my sister in Ukraine and they have so much snowfall heavy heavy snow And today it's up there. My sister says it's snowing again, very heavy, like a blizzard. So I guess that's the weather will come to us on Monday. We will have the same thing. She sent me a cute picture of the snowman they built up there. Let me see something. Uh, just a minute, I'm on the phone right now. Hold on. Okay, I will show you something. Okay. This is my sister and that's the where my mom live. She lived with my mom. She built the snowman. Look at this. So much snow. Let me see another what what else in here picture. Uh, well, kinda on this picture you can see how how much snow up there fall, and that's the uh, building next to the house that we kinda collect vegetables for the winter. Stay there. It's like halfway under the ground building was big fruit trees that barely any give any tree there's a bench across of mom's house so we always kind of sit here in the summer oh she sent me this picture it's like i want to go there oh look at this where's the snowman look how cute oh I can see close. I say, Luba, that's your boyfriend? <laughs> yeah, so she sent me this picture. It's like, oh, I want to be there. But to be honest, one time I went up there uh, in winter. And I was like, oh my God, no, I'm not going on a winter in Ukraine again. 
it's way too cold, lots of snow, I was always freezing. So after that we always go there only in the summertime. So it's nice and warm, we can go somewhere because in the winter there's nowhere to go. And uh, yeah, it's kind of like a hibernate in time, but at the same time when you live kind of in a farmhouse, you always have something to do because back then we have lots of animals. Now my mom have only chickens, just so they can have eggs. That's it. And my sister have a little piglet. Okay. I need to move my canvas again a little bit. This way. We used to have... <clears throat> oh well, let's talk about story about Ukraine. We used to have like three cows maybe three or four pigs, tons of chickens, lots of land with vegetables because whatever you have that's your food for the winter so yes lots of land with potatoes that you have to dig all fall time from morning to night because back then didn't really have like a tractors to help and lots of people still digging it by the hand and we all do that right there right now too but now my younger sister has a tractor so she can help now to dig out potato faster um, and then cows you know you have three cows and everybody in the street have the same you know cow who has one who has two whatever so as many cows as you have, you put them all, like one street, put all cows together and one household going with those cows to the field for a whole day and then bring them home back at night, like 8 o'clock or 9 o'clock in the summer, back home and all cows go to their own home, to the stable by themselves, they know where they live. So while a person who take care of cows for the day walking them through the streets, all fences open from each house and each uh, cow go to their own home, they know where to go. So when my husband saw this first, when we went up there and my, my kids, Canadian kids, they were very surprised how smart cows because they know where to go to home and bring the milk to the owner <laughs> so for them that was like wow they know where they live they go right into the building to their own stable and waiting for the owner to close the door so for them that was really unique and then one day uh, my mom was making a butter and you know when you own the cow you have your own homemade cheese homemade butter homemade you know sour cream and milk and um how you call it kefir uh what's the english word would be i can't remember well everything we can make from milk okay so my mom says well Don, you want to try to make a butter? He says, sure. So we have this like a, a wooden bucket, tall, thin, with the handle, the like a crisscross on the bottom to kind of make the cream go up and down, mixing it, right? And you have to kind of do it um, like up and down, up and down, right, with this bucket and maybe um, 20 minutes later because sometimes could be longer sometimes could be faster to make a butter it depends on the um, fatness of the cream and how um, old or young this cream so he made his first butter in ukraine he was amazed 
and <laughs> we were all very happy for him that he actually made it and he liked to tell the story to his friends that he actually made his own butter. He was very proud of it. <laughs> yes. So I know all the stuff have to make. If I stuck somewhere in the wild, I'm pretty much I can survive because I know lots of stuff of survivor. Basically, if you live uh, if you live in Ukraine, you're already surviving because up there everything you need to kind of you need to know how to live to survive. So yeah, so right now my mom already old, so she don't have now any animals, so only my sister keeping a one pig and mom have a chickens. That's it, she can't take care of anymore with her leg and her health. Okay, really, really love this canvas, love these diamonds, and I really have to kind of speed up a little bit and finish already. Also, I'm planning today to work a little bit on a Dreamer design canvas as well, and I'm thinking then you might want to see the canvas as well whip and chat right <laughs> because if I do myself and then you know here is the thing about whip and chats to create this kind of video and because I create videos every single day you have to talk about something what you can talk about every single day if it's like no news, <laughs> nothing new, it's winter, it's cold, I don't go nowhere, I stay home. So sometimes I'm just like, I have nothing to say, have, and just to be quiet and record video, I don't think you will like that if I just quiet. And also you don't like video if just music playing in the background because that way it wouldn't be fun because if you want to craft together with me you want to listen to me talking and tell you some stories because if you want to listen music you're just gonna turn your radio on instead right why you need a youtuber who create video with the music back around and not talking I don't like that either I like to have people talk to me that way I do what I do cross stitch or diamond paint and that person do the same thing and that's the fun part but those other people record video like once a week so they have lots to say from me how much news I can tell <laughs> see I have to dig deep into my memories to bring you something maybe like you know from my childhood some from back from home stuff because I don't know what to talk about. So sometimes I just like, okay, I would love to create video, but what I will tell you about? And to be honest, um, I start my video and I never know what I will talk about. I just kind of pick a subject as I do. And uh, sometimes it's a really a chit chat about nothing. All right, so I'm not sure how much I have now in this video from my first time we recorded with you a few days ago. So I hope it, it will be video at least, you know, maybe for 30 minutes, maybe 40. I'm not sure at this point. So I might well be uploading this video. 
and I will get my other canvas and work a little bit on brand new canvas from Dreamers Design and that way I will have some progress up there as well and you know what I would really appreciate if you want me to do another video on Dreamers Design can you please help me to pick the subject what should I do what kind of video should they do for Dreamers Design because I need to create video but I don't know um, they asked me to pick the subject what video should be about um, so please help me I will really appreciate okay now let me get you off the camera and show you what we done so far in here okay so here's the part that we've been working on on this left side of I mean right side of the canvas and as you can see we have some snow but not much so far we'll see how difference will make on Monday yeah uh, let me turn light on maybe we can get some few of the sparkles to see those diamonds look at now they are sparkling with the lights there's no sun yeah so I will be working from this side a little bit to map to my other side but I already created and actually if I can open for you then I can turn this so I can untangle a little bit I have my diamonds in the middle in here to keep it not flat my diamonds so this is how it's gonna look like absolutely stunning yeah so this side already done looks amazing I really really love it it's gorgeous so that's so far what I did from this side and then I'm gonna work from right side and meet up in the middle somewhere yeah looks looks gorgeous okay have a good day everyone and I will see you in my next video